Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q1 of the weekly contest 429. Minimum number of operations to make elements in a way distinct. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, drop me in Discord. Let me know what you think about this one. Yeah, this one, honestly, um, you can actually do this in a smart way by working backwards. Um, and I think that's what you should try to do as an upsell. But, uh, but for me, N is equal to 100. So, and I try to do this, you know, this is contest code. So I did it in a minute and 37 seconds. Um, because I just kind of did brute force. Um, I just look at subset and then I do a set. Um, this ticks O of n times every time and this is O of n-ish. So this is going to be n squared, but n is 100, so that's fine. But again, try to do an O of n kind of way if you're not doing it in a contest. Because even though you could do this in a contest, you can't do this on an interview for sure. Um, but yeah, and this is my code. It's pretty, um, you know, I, I, want, I want to, uh, you know, say is straightforward but uh but yeah um but well, i mean the way that i did is straightforward but that's intentional so i could get it out as soon as possible right so that is anyway let me know what you think and you could watch me solve it live during the contest next to register just like a new okay i mean only wasted like three four seconds maybe all right Okay, I mean, is the second one the same one? No, I don't know. Okay. Um, okay, so and okay, so uh, This is very yucky, honestly. But it should be okay. Unless I misunderstood it, which is always capable, especially these days, I feel. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about this one, this problem, this explanation, everything in between. Stay good, stay healthy to your mental health. I'll see y'all later and take care. Bye bye.